All right, I dry brined this brisket piece here. It's in the refrigerator. Uh, I'm gonna be putting it on the pit barrel cooker uh, in a little while. It's gonna be my first cook on the PBC. I've got that uh, fat in the little bag. It's gonna be beef tallow. Hopefully it's gonna render down and I'm gonna put it in the butcher paper and try to replicate the results uh, from Jeremy Yoder, the mad scientist barbecue guy who seems to think that beef tallow is the secret of Aaron Franklin for his brisket. So we're gonna see. Here I am getting uh about a fourth of the briquettes to fill this up here. I'm guessing that this thing holds a fourth. I guess I'll find out. It's about right. All right, here we go. Our piece of brisket. Right, just a little bit of garlic powder on there. Put a little bit more garlic powder in there. And then get some of this black pepper. All right, there we go. All right, and then I'm going to dump charcoal back, back on there. All right. All right. All right, now I'm going to go get the meat, let this warm up a little bit. Um, I think I've got to put the, uh, the rebar in first. Just want to make sure that that is through there for me. hook this brisket twice. I know it's small enough that it probably won't need it, but this is a rehearsal for another cook I'm going to be doing in a couple weeks. So let's see how it holds up there. I think I want it right about there. I'm going to push it through that. Just like there. And then I think I'm doing this right. Get that tension and push that through right there. All right. It looks like it's a very strong hold there. And here I've got that, so hopefully I'll get some tallow and I can see about putting that on the butcher paper. All right. So this is where we are at with my first cook on the PBC. Some lightning there. Um, I may not. I may have put it, uh, the meat on too quick trying to get it in before the storm. So, uh, anyways, may not turn out to be the best cook ever. But it's been interesting. Um, I've got my ink bird in that plastic bag there. Uh, hopefully it'll stay good. And I'll uh, keep an eye on the meat for men here. Well, it stopped raining, but I can hear thunder still in the distance. 
That brisket's looking pretty good uh, despite that rough start. Uh. First, gonna take out this. Ooh, that's kind of hot. Chow fish. Right. So my beef tallow there. Unfortunately, it started raining right when I wanted to get uh, this brisket wrapped. So, I'm going to put some of this on here. Let's see how this does. Alright, so there's our beef tallow. Oh wow. Really coming down now. I'm gonna have to wait on getting that brisket another few seconds. Take this out. Got it wrapped up there. Yeah. 
Definitely has that peppery smell, looks good. Mmm, yeah. Mmm, that's good. And the, the bark seems like it held up. So yeah, very good.